Hi Leo, this is Wendy from Wendy's Tarot. Welcome to my channel. In this video, we're going to do a reading where we're going to be looking at the person on your mind right now. Who is the person on your mind right now? Okay, so we're going to look at who they are, what they're feeling, what they're thinking, and what actions will they take towards you. All right, so let's get started. And um, if you end up enjoying this reading, if it ends up resonating with you, please give me a thumbs up. I appreciate that and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. All right, let's get started. Who is the person on Leo's mind spirit? Please show me who is this person on Leo's mind right now in regards to love. Feel the need for one more shuffle. My right, Leo, first card we have is the Eight of Swords in reverse. You might be connecting with an air sign, Gemini, Aquarius, or Libra for some of you. Let me see what else. The Chariot upright might be a Cancer. Okay, what else? The Fool upright might be an Aries. This person is releasing something that's been restricting them or that's been holding them back. Judgment in reverse. They want a new beginning. Nine of cups in reverse. They're unhappy with some sort of situation here. They want to make a change. The tower upright. Maybe connecting with a Scorpio also for some of you. Um, yeah, they wanna they want a drastic change. They want a drastic uh, transformation. Um, they're ready to let go of something. They're ready to move away from something or move on from something. Um, they feel like they they've been held back for too long. They feel like they've been restricted for too long. Um, the chariot for some of you. This person is traveling to see you. For some of you, this person is at a distance. Um, for some of you, this person has a new car. And they're coming to see you in their new car. <laughs> I don't, that's specific. <laughs> yeah. Not seeing too much about feelings. How does this person feel about Leo spirit? How does this person feel about Leo? What are their feelings for Leo? We have here the devil. For some of you, this person is obsessed with you. The Knight of Wands, yeah, they're obsessed with you. They're they they're really attracted to you. Um, they feel a lot of passion for you. What else? Yeah, King of Wands, a lot of fire. Um, they feel like you're hard to get, and they like that about you. They like that you make it hard for them, that you make it difficult for them to um, to impress you or to win you over. For some of you, this person likes drama. What else? The strength card might be another Leo. Seven of Pentacles in reverse. They feel like you're not interested in them. They feel like you're turning your back to them and you're not putting in the work or the effort into being with them or into having a relationship with them. Okay, <laughs> let's see now, um, what are your feelings for this person? 
Spirit, please show me what are Leo's feelings for this person. Thank you. How does Leo feel about this person? Thank you. For some of you, this person is really sexually attracted to you also. Okay, we have here the death card in reverse in regards to your feelings. We have the knight of swords upright. Three of cups upright. So Leo, there might be someone else here you're involved with here with the three of cups. Um, you might be putting attention more so on somebody else than on them. What else? Four of Wands in Reverse, and Page of Swords in Reverse. Um, for right now, you it's like you don't really want a relationship with them, um, but you do. Um, but you do look back and like check up on them from time to time. Um, again, there might be a third party situation on your side. Or maybe you feel like it's on their side also, like maybe you feel like they're playing games with you. Um, I feel like it's on your side though. Let's see what else. Five of Cups. So you suffered a disappointment with this person and you're not really interested in repeating another disappointment with this person. So I feel like you're kind of turning your back to them, but you're it's almost like halfway. You haven't completely turned your back to them. Um, you might be exploring other options in love, though. All right. What actions will this person take towards you? Let's see that. Spare, what actions will the person on Leo's mind take towards Leo, please? What is the outcome here? And we have Eight of Wands in reverse. Communication is going to stop between you two. Strength card. Someone's going to give up. Page of Pentacles in reverse. No, no commitment is going to be offered. Nine of Cups in reverse. Someone is sad and frustrated and unhappy. Seven of Cups upright. Knight of Pentacles in reverse. So I feel like this person is going to try to move on from you. They're going to try to look for other options in love. Um, because they feel like that's what you're also doing. Um, they feel like things aren't going anywhere. They're stuck between you two. Um, they're unhappy. They, they're unhappy because it's not going the way they planned. No. Yeah, I feel like this person didn't wasn't successful in convincing you, you know. That's what I feel. It's like you didn't trust them completely. Like you were kind of open to them a little bit, but not really. It's like more than anything, it's like you didn't trust you don't trust them. Um, because they've let you down before, they've disappointed you before, and you don't want to repeat a cycle with this person. And I feel like this person is going to give up eventually and stop communication with you, and um, they're going to look for someone else. All right, that's what I see there, Leo. So let me know if this resonated. If it did, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't. I really appreciate that, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye, Leo. Take care.